Here's Alyssa. Alrighty, one more check on the weather and tracking Santa. We're going to continue to do that all through the evening hours. So make sure you join us back here at 11 p.m. to see where Santa is and if he's closer to Indianapolis. Right now we are still looking. Let's see here. We're looking live with you guys. So we are finding out in real time. He's still in Madrid. So all through the evening shows with us, he has been to Zurich. He's been to Budapest and now into Madrid. So that's a thousand miles closer than we started off our evening shows at 5 p.m. So he's doing work. He's moving very quickly, but still in ocean away from us and from Indiana, but he's going to get here really soon. And when he does, he might have some rain showers to deal with, depending on what time he finally decides to pop on over to Indiana, because we do have light rain on the way for our Christmas Eve. And then we're waking up on Christmas morning to some scattered showers and even some isolated thunderstorms. So we could get a good amount of rainfall here in the morning hours, maybe about a half a quarter, an inch to a half an inch, depending on where we get some of those thunderstorms in there. But the rest of the day for Christmas is going to start to dry out and temperatures are going to be in the low 60s tonight and we're going to continue on with those 60s as we head to Christmas. So near record warmth, we're going to be having a high around 62 degrees. It's a warm Christmas. All right, Alyssa, thank you and thank you for joining us for CBS 4 News at 6 o'clock. CBS Evening News with Nora 